In today's video, I'm revisiting the same say soundbar I tested out a little while ago. This is a 29 inch stereo speaker that helps enhance the sound from your TV or pretty much any kind of audio source. This is a fairly simple soundbar, but it offers several types of inputs with manual controls found on the right side. Speaking of inputs, on the back there's an optical port and RCA inputs, and on the side you'll find a 3.5mm aux port. It's really nice to have all these options depending on the TV or device you're connecting to the soundbar. You can also control the soundbar from your couch using this remote control. Right now you're listening to the sound from my Samsung TV speakers. And now let's listen to the soundbar. I know the audio quality is about average and the frequencies mainly come from the mid to high range and I want to emphasize it's mostly on the high frequencies. You'll definitely need a subwoofer if you want bass but that's going to be the case with a lot of soundbars. And if you want to mount this to the wall, the speaker already has brackets on the back just for that. And one thing I forgot to mention is that this speaker can also connect through Bluetooth, which is a plus if you're trying to eliminate wires. To me, this is a basic soundbar that essentially does what it's made to do, and it has pretty much every kind of input you'd need. And in my original review, I did have connection problems with the two LG HDTVs I own, but there were no problems with the Samsung TV you saw in this video. I hope you found this overview helpful, and I'll be in the comments if you have any questions about the soundbar. Thanks for watching.